Hello my dear Whoop friends. This is the new Woo Charger W63 from GetRC, a one cell charger with six charging ports. In this video, you'll learn why the GetRC Woo Charger is the best one cell charger on the market in 2025. This is, of course, just my opinion, the opinion of an experienced Whoop racer. But I promise you'll quickly see in this video why I like the GetRC Woo Charger W63 the best. And why it might be something for you too. By the way, this video is not sponsored. And I bought this GetRC Woo Charger W63 with my own money. I'm making this video just for you, my Whoop friends. So that as many people as possible know what they're buying and can make the right purchasing decision. If you are new to this channel, please also check out my other videos and tutorials. I have put a lot of work into some of them and would be happy if many people see the videos and get help. Because I don't have many videos of new products on my channel like other channels, I rely on your support in the form of likes, subscriptions and comments, my friends. In this way, my videos are still appreciated by the YouTube algorithm. And so I can continue to offer you independent advice from my extensive whoop race experience as well as my many years of model flying experience with 3D RC helicopters. Scale RC helicopters and RC aerobatic airplanes and more. You can see part of it on my second German language YouTube channel. Thank you in advance, my Whoop friends. For me, the GetRC Woo Charger W63 is the best charger because it has the following new features. It can charge with 3 amps per port, which is twice as much as the other chargers. With 3 amps, a 1 cell 550 mAh LiPo can be charged in 10 to 15 minutes. This is very practical when you need to charge quickly. For example, if you want to fly shortly before sunset but don't have time to spend a long time charging the lipos. For me personally, this was the main selling point. I will charge my lipos with 3 amps every now and then. The modern, larger 1 cell high capacity lipos can handle this without any problems. They don't even get warm. The second feature I like is the slightly higher discharge current of 0.5 amps. Of course, that's still low, but at least it's better than the 0.3 amps of the Vifly Whoop Store V3. What I also really appreciate is the individual programming of the charge ports. This allows me, for example, to charge two 300 milliamperes per hour lipos at 0.6 amps and, at the same time, four 550 milliamperes per hour lipos at 3 amps. The auto charge function is also important to me personally, it starts charging immediately after plugging in a lipo. It's also important to me that the buzzer can be turned on and off because I often charge late at night and don't want to disturb anyone with the buzzer. In the table I created, you can quickly and easily see the main differences at a glance. The GetRC Woo Charger W63 also has another new feature that's nice to have, it displays the milliamp hours charged into the LiPo batteries. The only question is how accurate this information is. It seems very inaccurate when discharging, but it might be useful when charging. And I almost forgot a feature that's also very important to me, but which I only discovered after the purchase. It's the ability to individually adjust the input voltage warning. This means I can now decide for myself how deeply I want to discharge my input LiPo batteries. This feature is a must-have. I'm very happy that GetRC has introduced this function. In my opinion, the GetRC Woo Charger W63 is definitely the best one cell charger of 2025. In the rest of the video, I'll show you a few pictures of the package contents in the instruction manual. This way, you can always return to this video if, for example, you've lost some information about the package contents. In the video description, you'll find the most important information in writing, as well as updates if I discover anything new. Also check out the comments on this video. Sometimes you'll find additional information there. You're welcome to leave a comment, of course. If this video was valuable to you, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to show me that you want to see more videos like this. Happy flying, my whoop friends!
my Woo friends. The Woo in this video is the Meteor 75 Pro from Beta FPV, but not in the stock version. In my Butterfly FPV version with some modifications. For example, some holes in the canopy as well as in the frame to make it lighter. Direct soldered motor cables to the board without motor plugs. AWG20 main cable. BT2.0 main connector. Titanium motor screws and tiny whoop pinch cam as well as an OVX300 VTX from Happy Model and that's about it. I do have some videos about those modifications and some other videos on my channel, please check them out.